everybody, I'm Keychain. Um, today we're doing something a little different. I migrated to server 573 and we have our first free for all. Uh, so 24 hours, everything goes, you know, no attacking farms and they don't want you to zero people. So no, no teleporting people and, and booting them. Um, so it means you get four hits on castles and should be a good time. Now, I don't really know where I stand as far as power on this server, um, but you can see not a whole lot of people are properly bubbled up right now. So we're gonna go get started, um, especially with this alliance because they have a guy earlier that was going a little crazy mouthing off and he said some things to me that crossed the line. So it definitely made me angry. Um, yeah, here we go. We're going to start. Um, start by scouting because in this game, attacking costs stamina. So just blindly attacking people is going to waste valuable attacks, going after things that um, aren't there. Like I'm looking for resources, and if they don't have any, I'm not, I'm not here to kill troops. I'm here for resources. So this guy has sand, which I need. So we'll take a hit off of him. Nope, he's shielded now. Um, let's see. This one will scout. And you got to be careful. I've got to be careful here not to do any farms. And... I've got to be careful of attacks coming in because I don't know how these guys fight, but there are some monsters on this server. Let me tell you, um, <laughs> I'll show you in just a minute here. Like there are some absolute monsters on this server. Okay. So this one has resources, so I'm going to attack him and I want to get closer for that because I don't want to get caught out with my troops being far away. So here when I'm attacking somebody I'm gonna get close and while we're waiting for this to hit look how fast my march goes um, getting lots of resources here Ooh, yummy so I get four hits on this guy without teleporting him but each one costs five stamina so I'm gonna burn you know 25% of my stamina with these four attacks so that's the one downside um, for me personally on this game is you can't really go attacking for a long time. Um, you got to kind of plan it out and yeah, who's messaging me? And they're getting rain. So there are some people active here. But will any of them attack me? That's the thing that we're waiting to see. So there's a guy over here called Nix. Daniel Scotty. Kaz is pretty big. That guy's 23 million. Probably avoid that. Let's scout this one. So because they rained, I don't know what they have, but I'm going to avoid that because I got most of the resources already. I don't know why he called me a janitor. <laughs> Maybe it's a translation, I don't know. But... Okay, so Popeye... I already scouted Popeye, didn't I? Yeah, I already scouted Popeye, he didn't have anything. I scouted the other guy, he didn't have anything. Um, try not to make you guys sick scrolling through. I mean, I'm going to have to go check out Nyx if there's no resources here. 128 million resources on Mystical Ant. So, let's get closer. Make sure there's no rain in here. It's not labeled as a farm. So, fair game. Nope, they're raining. <laughs> oh, they're good. Okay, I like it. 
I like it. Um, I need to be faster if I'm going to hit here. Look, they just filled her up with rain anywhere I go. That's awesome. So if any of them do decide to watch this, um, you know, it's not hard feelings, guys. I'm just participating in the free-for-all. Um, and good job on the raining because it's actually, it's really impressive. So this guy has all four of his... Um, his marches on defense, which means that I would kill a ton of troops. Like, I don't know, five or six hundred thousand. And I don't know that I want to do that um, because it is within our server. So I'm going to leave that one alone too. Um, I'm trying not to be super destructive here for the free-for-all. That's not my goal. My goal is to, um, is to attack inactive castles um or to just you know get some get some resources that people left open right i don't want to cripple people and make them hate me for attacking them during the free-for-all that's not the end game goal here this guy was just taking resources from them so i can go take resources from him right So let's see what I get. Oof. A little bit of a harder hit than I expected. Um, like I was just saying, this was not my goal. I didn't intend to fully wreck somebody like that. Um, but he's out attacking, so I guess that one's fair game. It's not like he's just somebody that forgot to put their shield up for... for Free for all day. There's been so many attacks. It's not my hive. Oh, who's attacking me? Oh gosh, I hope he doesn't try and attack me. He's going to end up super hurt. Um, This one, not really enough resources to care about. This one has a lot of soil and I really need soil right now. So I am going to attack this one. Um, but I'm going to use my second march, so I get just that, and to try and get this guy to attack me, this, this dude here. Maybe he'll see my march out and think that he can attack me. So how much did I get with my secondary march? I can pull about 3.7 million, and he had five, so I can attack him a second time with that march to get the rest of the soil that I wanted. And I'll leave him alone. Um, the thing that I should have done or that I want to work on is getting my second march up to full capacity so that I can use two marches to collect resources with. Um, there is a way to use your stamina on all your marches, which is moving your main ants into the next march and then moving them into the next march. And I'm just too lazy for that. Uh, not... Not something I really want to do. Let's see, does this guy have any I mean the other guy was in here scouting, but I'm gonna I'm gonna scout for myself. Oh, I need to be careful too. Did I accidentally hit a farm? No, it just says gris, so it's not a farm. There's a word for a uh, farm that they're using, it's like ganja. So if it says ganja, that one is um, fair game, so it's or not fair game. So f the word farm or ganja in any of these castles are off limits. So that's what we're avoiding. Madman, he has meat and honeydew. Don't want that. So I think that's it for this hive. Let's go check out pig. What's down here? Um, SNZ is a sister alliance, so we can attack that one. I swear there was another alliance, but I'm like 90% sure that I wasn't checking carefully. And I'm guessing the alliance pig is like a farm alliance. That sounds like what you would name a farm alliance. At least I think it would be a clever farm alliance. 
So this guy, they're all shielded. I mean, this may be a short video if I don't find any other, like, look at everybody's already, like, in this game you don't burn, you get, like, your hail is, is dusted. See how these are all dusted? So these are what the equivalent of on fire in other games. So you can see here that um, <laughs> they are already going ham and everybody's being hit. So my... My bookmarks and these big hives are the ones that are going to be already burning. So, this one isn't super on fire. I mean, there are, no, there are a lot. So I'm guessing the other ones either didn't have resources or maybe they weren't super th thorough or... I don't know why they stopped here, but I'm going to teleport in here and check some of these out and see what they've got. Let's see if we can find anything worth attacking out of these. So some of the ones that got skipped, like this one. Um, and the other thing that I have done um, is... So this one has sand. I'm kind of good on sand, but I might come back to it. Sergio has plants, honeydew, and meat. Don't want it. This guy has plants. Um, I think I'll hit him with my secondary march. Um, let me make sure I'm not attacking wrong. Kin info. No, that's fine. So we're going to invade that with my second march. What were the other ones? So there's meat and sand there. Don't really care about it. This one has plants. Like, I guess the resource that I really want, the one that I'm like after for the most, is um, I guess sand and soil. So, oh, this is at the hive that I already left. Oops. I should have checked that before I. Um, before I ran. Oh, I need to keep myself healing um, also. All right, so who else? Um, let's scout this guy down here. Let's scout this guy here who is in the middle and is not burning. Wait, do these say farm? One doesn't say farm. It's not labeled farm at all. Tanex doesn't mean anything to me. So ideally, too, in this game, I'm looking for level 19 and above hills um, because when you attack lower level hills, you get less resources back. So it's not super worth it to attack hills that, um, you know, don't meet your your three level threshold and that's the other thing that i've done is i've intentionally kept myself at Ant hill 22 until i'm ready to push all the way to 25 because if you go to 23 you go to 24 it makes it so you can only attack you know three levels below yourself to maximize your resource gain and it kind of cripples you so this guy has a good strategy with having all that meat open and i usually do that too is i open a bunch of meat before i go raiding because then if someone does attack me and they succeed, they're forced to take 25% of it as um, <laughs> as meat. So it kind of makes it so that um, that you have to, you know, be strategic with your marches or you won't get as many resources back. So this was a good hit against the Senju guy. So what did he have? How much did he have? So he just has... So I got the soil and the and the sand already. Um, I guess I could get some more plants out of him. I'll probably do that because I do have some um, training day coming up. So I guess I do need leaves because as a carrier main, I use a lot of leaves. So um, what did Sergio have? Sergio just had plants and meat. Not much. So nothing too big. So I'll attack this guy one 
two more times. And then I'll attack Sergio with my second march also. Unless, does he have defense? Sergio, I lost it. Sergio's defending with 304,000, so the amount of resources that I'll get by attacking him probably aren't worth, you know, what I would lose. Like, I'll get some resources back, but then I lose more than what I'm gaining because I'll probably lose, you know, 15 or 20k troops to, you know, his defenses. Okay, so he had 12 million plants. I think I got a majority of it. I think I've got one more attack. And we'll do that. And then I'm going to leave Sergio alone. <clears throat> Is there anybody else close that didn't get hit that meets the threshold? If not, we'll check. We'll check another hive. See if we can't find any hidden gems or anybody that just got skipped or left just a ton of resources open um let's see did i even get resources on this one yep so i cleaned them out um let's check what's this guy zombie tbl they are a smaller little alliance out in the middle of nowhere they do have some 19s that probably would give some resources um Gosh, I'll go check it out because why not? And then I'm kind of out of targets. Like I didn't, I didn't spend as much time making bookmarks as I normally do. Um, like if you're from my Guns of Glory community, you saw that you know I would spend hours and hours getting bookmarks. And here, I didn't do that. I um, I spent a good amount of time, like twenty or thirty minutes, but I didn't really comb the map for enemies because it's also the same server. So. Oh my gosh. That is a lot of the resources I need. Thank you, Nathan. Um, Nathan Shielded. Not thank you, Nathan. So this guy has nothing. This guy has a lot of resources. A lot of defending troops, but... Gosh, I think... Oh, nope, it's a farm. Okay, so see how it says farm? That's what you got to pay attention to. So even though his name doesn't say it, he says farm in there. So I can't attack that one. I don't want to break the rules of the server. So we're going to avoid that one. We'll open our ants real quick, and then I'll go check the last hive I have bookmarked. And then maybe I'll, um, <clears throat> I'll creep on what some other people are attacking and see what hives they're in. So this guy is out by himself in the middle of the nowhere. I think that he's probably an inactive. I'm hoping that he's just loaded with resources, but let's find out. But let's see. Not labeled farm. Vinso from Vin. And he is loaded with resources, just like I wanted. So... This one I am going to use my main march because he's got so many resources and I want to maximize. And I'm kind of running out of targets, so if I run out of stamina at this point, it's not a big deal. Alright, so zero loss. Let's see what we got. Um, ooh, good stuff. I don't remember how much meat he had. I, oh, I hope he didn't have too much. Like, the meat is getting in my way. So before I can get the big chunks of soil that I want, he's going to be out of attack range. So I'll finish clearing out the meat, and then on that last hit that I would get all soil is when I won't be able to attack him anymore. Oh, so he's already at 11%, so I can't even attack him again. Um, I could either wait here <laughs> to get those resources, um, which <laughs> I might do, or let's see what other people are attacking. So Krosin is at Zin. Um, do I have Zin bookmarked? I don't even think I have Zin bookmarked. So let's bookmark Zin Hive. Um, and is it just her down there attacking? Let's see. 
I mean, there's not much here. From initial glances, there's a untagged. There's a level 20 over here. A 19. I mean, I think, gosh, I guess since it's my last, probably my last stop, I can, let's stop in here, see if anybody's got a ton of resources, and see if they're worth, you know, trying to get. If they're not, then we'll be done, and this will be a short and sweet video. Okay, so this guy's just got a bunch of meat. Don't care. This guy has honeydew. Don't care. Is this one burning? That one's not burning yet. Let's scout it. Um, okay, so... Monty will scout. Mad Hatter's here too. Dang it. There's just so many of us that are bloodthirsty right now that this is going to end quickly. 13.1, all of it's honeydew. Don't care. This one, a little bit of plants. Um, but, but this one has 30 million. Again, a big chunk of meat in the way of what I want. But... Gosh, I think I think I'm gonna go for it on this one because I think I'm done. So let's do it. Um, and then yeah, I think that's it. So I do really like this server so far. Oh, I said I was gonna show you guys these leaderboards. Watch this. Holy crap! Right? Like 74 million, 51 million, 37, 30, 30. Like so. I'm only at 20 million power right now. Prior to my war on my previous server, I was pushing 25 million power, but we fought a lot. And I lost a ton of troops um, defending people, you know, fighting back in the war. So had I not been in a war, I would still be close to top 10. But right now I'm ranked 30 on this server because of fighting um, on my previous server. So it is what it is, but for now, that's kind of what I'm at. So I can get, I mean, I can get a decent amount of resources from this guy. Let's get back there. Let's get my two more attacks in. And then we'll go, like, I don't know. I don't want to stop. It's so much fun. <laughs> Maybe I won't be done. Let's stick with me a little while longer. Let's see what we can find. And then we'll go from there. So this guy, I want to attack two more times without kicking him. That's what we're talking about. Look at those resources. Ooh, good resources. Okay, what did he have total? He had like 24 million resources total. And we're pulling four, six, six and a half per attack. So this last one will still give resources. I think 24% is above the teleport threshold, so it should not kick him. Oh, nope, I screwed that up. I, it's on video, I'm sorry, to that guy. Um, I need to say sorry to him. I thought 24% was above the teleport threshold, but apparently I'm wrong. Um, okay. I will figure out how to send him a message, say my bad, and how do I even do that? Okay, I know how to do it. So let's go here, info, view alliance, alliance members. We're looking for uh, 
Oh gosh, this is harder than I thought it was going to be. We're looking for ABB. There he is. Why didn't that let me click him? Mail. Cheese for the teleport. My math was wrong. Check the video on youtube.com slash keychain gaming. Okay. Um, it happens. So now I know that 24% is not safe to hit. Um, whoa. 253 million resources. Is this guy? Okay, I, I was thinking that he was actually saying that they found a bunch of resources, but I think he's just trying to um, taunt people. So, DUI Hive. Has anybody been here yet? Doesn't look like it, but DUI has some monsters. So, maybe that's why. Nobody's gone here. Why didn't anybody go to DUI? I think nobody went to DUI because of this. There's some monster dude in here. Um, Spider. Yeah, this guy. 37 million. Uh, Hill 25. But I'm going to go for it. So, prop of, prop of rule. I don't know what that means, but we're going to teleport somewhere in the middle over here and see what they've got. So let's get some scouts off. Let's see what we can find. We are pretty low on, um, on stamina now. No resources there, don't care. All meat, don't care. Um, doo -doo -doo. Maybe that's why nobody's burning here, because they don't have anything good. <laughs> Let's scout this. Let's scout this. Um, scout this. What do we have? 9.3 million. Uh, there is meat in the way, but he's got sand. So I think this one's a good candidate for a hit or two. Oh, where'd it go? Sorry, it got zoomed out. So we'll hit him real quick. Let's check the other ones. Plants. So if I send my secondary march, I'll get only plants. I won't get any honeydew. So this will actually work out pretty well once one of these returns. Nine seconds. This one has mostly meat. This one has kind of mostly meat honeydew. So vampire, I got the sand that I wanted. And how much sand did he have? My memory is terrible. Okay, one more hit on vampire. Um, so we'll do that, and then I was going to hit who with my secondary march. It was Poppy. So we're going to hit Poppy with my secondary march. Um, because the thing in this game is if you use your pro march as a raider, you can gain um, honeydew. If you use a secondary march, um, any of your three secondary or secondary, any of your three non-pro unit marches, I should say, then you can't gather honeydew from attacking. 
So it actually works in your favor if you are after the other resources because then honeydew doesn't take up any of your troop load on the way back. So here I got all of the plants. I think I could have carried up to like 4 million plants. So that is pretty decent. So that's a farm right there. So I can't attack that one. Let me scout this one. Um, let's scout this one. Zoom out a little bit. And I think that'll be it for this hive. I don't see... I don't see anything else. That guy has already been hit. Um, that one doesn't say farm, right? CM Priva is not farm. Okay. And there are... There's a lot of troops defending there um, for me to get just the 3 million soil that I want. So I would end up taking the meat and the honeydew and the soil, but it's probably not worth hurting him for that. This one has not very much meat. This one's a better target for me. So how far away is this? 32 seconds. That's kind of far. I'm going to teleport. I like to be quick. I like to get in, get my hits, and have my march return. Um, having a march 30 seconds away means if someone attacks me, I have to use a teleport anyways to avoid that attack. So I might as well teleport close to the target um, to avoid that happening. And then we're good to go. And then, is there anywhere else? So Kin, I've already looked at them. I think I'm done. Uh, I think this was a good run. Oh, I cleaned that out, so I didn't even need the second hit. Um, so now we're going to teleport away and wait for the shields to come up. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, there will be more Lost Island content coming but not from my other account. Um, I might do one or two more videos from that. But on that brand new account, I can't have nearly as much fun. Because I can't take part in any of the fighting. All of the people that I'm with are like 800% stats. Uh, and I, I can't really do anything. And my marches are tiny. Like I just can't do anything. So um, looking here, coming soon is our, is our preview. So I'm guessing that it'll be in three days we'll get our initial phase, which is like, then you have to wait a week and then you have to sign up and then you have to pick. So in like, I don't know, two weeks from now, we'll actually get to go into Lost Island on my main account. Um, I might decide to go up to Ant Hill 25 before that, just so I have tier nines when we go in. I'm not fully set on that yet, um, but I'll show you also while we're here, my progress. Um, one of the things that I've done to kind of guide that along is looking at, did I accidentally collect troops? No, I didn't, good. So looking at my depots, I've got my level three depot for plant, soil, um, whatever, all these at six, and then my sand is, at, is on its way to seven. Um, I'm doing this so that I don't have any blockers once I start my, um, once I start my, my building to 25, because other people said that they had to use a ton of diamonds to go around having to level these up. And I figure it doesn't hurt to have your depots leveled in the long run. So I'm just going to go for it. But again, end of my videos, it's like, I know that I should end it, but it's fun to keep talking and hanging out. But uh, I think I'm going to end it there. Uh, thank you for watching. Remember to hit the like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.